What, what is that? Two bikes and a scooter. Here we go. Nice, Chris. Morning. Here in Mississippi. See you a little bit. shoulder up your shoulders are level you're gonna look straight forward you're gonna relax take deep breaths you're stretching your shoulder your neck okay you have multiple muscle groups in that area you have your deltoid you have your trapezius which is the back muscle on your neck and you have your neck you have several muscle groups that come down and connect with shoulder clavicle spine all right relax now do this for the uh, opposite side. Remember you're keeping your shoulders aligned. Looking straight forward, taking deep breaths. Focus on breathing from your belly. Inhale, exhale. As we mentioned in the past, if you feel discrepancy, meaning one side is tighter than the other, that is normal. All you need to do is focus on working on balancing it out. Now. We're gonna stretch arms. You're gonna bring both arms up. You're gonna bring your right hand on your left shoulder. Left hand on your elbow. You're stretching your tricep muscle. That's the back of your bicep. Tricep muscle coming down here, behind your arm, upper part of your arm. It also works your back muscle, which is called latissimus dorsi, or back muscle as many call it. All right, that same arm across your chest. Bring your arm across your chest. What's up, buddy? All right, just take deep breaths. And if you do this outside, fantastic way to hear the birds, hear nature. Connect with nature, guys. Arms extended, now we're doing the other side. Grabbing your elbow, hand on your shoulder, stretching your shoulder, your, 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 your triceps. All right, arm across your chest. Same thing, you should feel more than likely that you have one side tighter than the other, that's okay. Alright, now, bending your knees, 
arms extended. You're gonna be opening up your chest and looking up to the sky. All right, open your chest. That feels good on your shoulders, on your chest, on your abs. All right, now you're gonna extend and reach forward, bending your back, okay? You should feel this along your back, lower back area. Fantastic. Now, you're gonna bring your feet a little bit wider, toes, feet, pointing straight forward, okay? You're gonna bring one arm up and extend to the side. In my case, I'm doing my right arm over. I'm trying to keep my body straight aligned, not leaning to the side. Straight forward. Take deep breaths. Okay, relax. Other side. Great way to stretch your back, especially if you're sitting. You're spending a lot of time sitting. I would guess that's working on your homework. However, I'm sure you're sitting, watching TV, or playing video games. Stretching is important, guys. Yeah, yes. Okay. Okay. Kiddos want to do a stretch, and I'm gonna. It's gonna be a good way for them to incorporate their favorite stretch. But let's focus on the legs first, and then you guys have a chance. All right, hands on your knees, bringing your legs in between, your hands in between your legs, stretching, locking your knees, lock your knees, point your bottom, your hips towards the sky, guys. Feel that so with your lower back. All right, now, you're gonna bring one foot forward and one foot back, opening up, just like if you're doing the giant step lunges that we've done before. You're gonna bring up one knee down, and you're gonna be extending forward, pushing your hip forward. You should feel that on your belly. It's called your hip flexor area, hip flexor. Okay, to add to that, you can bring your arm up, Stretch your a little bit deeper. All right, alternate. Arm up, pushing forward. All right, the kids want to do a stretch style. Why don't you start us? called again? Uh, it's, there are two names for it, Ragdoll and Elephant. Ragdoll or Elephant. Fantastic. Okay. Should we incorporate the sound? No. No? The sound? Hey brother, do it. Come on bro. Well that feels good. It could be the thing All right, Sebastian, bro. Okay. Show us. Uh, that is called, frog I don't, pose. that's called like a, like frog a, pose. a frog pose. And if you can put like your legs All right. out. If you're eight years old like he is, you probably can do that. I probably can. Yeah. I'm an attempt. I'm a good sports. Uh, but yes, I can. Fantastic. And this one is called frog pose and, and it's a stretch, Sebastian? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, fantastic. Thank you, guys. It's Friday. Weekend, enjoy your weekend, guys. Make sure to be active, make sure to enjoy nature, make sure to go outside and just listen. Listen to the sounds of nature. A lot of times that helps us. It's not this is not just for the kids. This message to parents go outside, relax, take a breather, go for a walk. Okay, take a time out for yourself and go for a walk. Take care of yourself, it's important. Take care of yourself. As a parent of two, I know it's difficult. And I know we're dealing with a, uh, 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 a lot of questions from our kiddos, but you know, we just need to focus on what we have control in. And, you know, day by day.
Enjoy your weekend. Take care. Be safe. Be kind. Be mindful. Be good to each other. Bye. Bye.